I've expressed that even myself. When you do fasting, third day, by the third day, the food that you have eaten becomes dry in your, in your stomach. But nothing is entering. They become dry. And they have to go down and close down there. I'm sure you understand what I'm trying to say. Amen. All right. The fourth day, when it's closing down there, the one that is left sustain you on the fourth day. You still have, feeling like you have got energy, but you have to do, <laughs> isn't it? Eh? You have to do like that. But on the fifth day, you forget. You forget. You don't go to the toilet. Nothing is moving. The body say, no, this man, why doesn't he take something? And the demons that are there in the body, they say, ah, Pella, this man <laughs> is giving us problems. What are we going to eat here? The demons inside, they say, M4. You know, they call each other names. Maybe they call each other by your name. <laughs> <laughs> They are communicating together. Demons inside you. And they say, ah, hey, when? Your name is what? Chiriz. Kosan. Yeah. Say, hey, Kosi. Another one says, Chili. <laughs> they, are, they are talking. This other one says, ah, are you going to survive this? Are you hearing me? Another one says, are you sure this man will, will stop? If it doesn't stop here, the fire is increasing. You understand? The fire is increasing, and we've got nothing to eat. Demons love eating. Demons love what? Eating. I'm giving you a revelation. This one, demon called Chilizi, ask this one. Because remember, they are there with, there's another one that is a boss, and this another one is a servant. Are you hearing that? This one says, no. The food that is here is small. You go first. Go and search around. If we can enter someone, me, I will remain. Because I've been assigned and I call you to come. So this one will go out. I say, hey, as <laughs> you And you, now you feel dizzy. And you don't know that dizzy means something is leaving you. I don't know if you're hearing me. Amen. You go to the sixth day. This other one who's big say, no, man. This person cannot, cannot get a breakthrough, man. No. It's a fight. Life is all about fighting. This one say, no, he can't get a breakthrough. If he get a breakthrough, he's going to trouble us. It means me, I'm defeated. Therefore, it means they have to assign a bigger one. Because if I'm going to be defeated, I will be destroyed. This is okay. I will stay until Sunday on the seventh day. But if he reaches there, hi, Gabale can. So from there, that one come back to check. They say, oh, that man, oh, me, I cannot enter there. Now they are talking. Hey, of course. Another one said, Chile. You know, they are talking. And of course, he said, hi. So Chile said, yeah, man. Go to the one that is fighting whom whom. Go to the one that is fighting whom whom. Maybe it will come here. He said, no, I'm not going there. I've not been assigned. You fight. And now that demon will say, boom, and run away. You came here like bones, like this. Are you hearing me? Amen. You come here like, boy, but there's victory in you. Amen. Don't worry when you're losing things. Bigger things are coming. Amen. Satan will take this and take that, take this. You know, when you're going to the next level, you say, oh, no, we know now. This man can fight the principalities. And those who fight principalities are supposed to live this kind of life. Because you, you are fighting a snake of the family. You understand? And now, this snake defeated everyone. You have not even fought a demon of the village. Amen. 